what's up welcome back to my youtube channel it has been forever since i've posted on here i'm so sorry today i'm doing another review of a beauty big bang product and if you haven't seen my other videos you should check them out because they have very affordable super cool makeup beauty products sorry i'm in the car because it's like the most quiet place right now since we have loud fans and stuff in the house they have a really wide variety of beauty products actually they have like hair products makeup products um, nail products before we get started I want to remind you guys that I have a 10% off coupon code that'll be in the description and it's also somewhere over here as well so you guys can get an additional 10% off of your purchase that is pretty crazy because it's already really cheap I am not being paid to film this by the way so this is my honest review but they did send me the products for free so thank you to Beauty Big Bang and I have loved everything they've sent me so far so let's get into the video I'm starting off with a thin layer of this UV top coat from Amazon. I like to make sure that it's not too thick so that it doesn't run onto my skin or cuticles. Now I'm carrying it for two minutes with my UV lamp. I try to always remember to use these funny looking gloves so that I can protect my skin as much as possible. This chrome powder is from Amazon as well. It's really subtle but it's so pretty and it creates a unicorn mermaid type look. This is just going to be the base for underneath the chrome holographic flakes from Beauty Big Bang. So next, I'm gonna put on another clear top coat and then cure it for two more minutes. All right, this is the fun part. I'm lightly patting on the hollow flakes at the bottom of my nail. And once they're almost completely off of my sponge applicator, I'm patting them towards the top of the nail and this will give it that ombre effect. You can also do this in reverse if you'd rather have the top of your nail completely covered in it and that looks really pretty as well. To make sure that this doesn't get scratched off, I'm putting one more top coat on and curing for two more minutes. I also wipe off my brush between nails so that I don't get a bunch of the flakes in my polish because that can be annoying when you go to paint your nails later. Alright, that's it. We're all done. The ombre effect that this makes is so pretty and these were definitely my favorite nails that I have ever done on myself and I just was so sad to take them off. If you guys follow me on Instagram, you have probably seen me talking about two different apps that I've been on lately. One is called Vigo Video and the other is Bigo Live. I just started on Vigo last month and I post daily videos on there so you should check it out. Bigo Live is a broadcasting app and I will be broadcasting on that starting next month pretty much every single day. So if you guys want to come chat with me, I would really appreciate it. I love talking to you guys and yeah, you guys should go check it out. Subscribe if you haven't already because I will be posting a lot more now. I no longer work for Six Flags and I miss my friends there very much, but I've missed you guys so much as well. I love posting on here for you guys and it's made me sad when I haven't been able to. Turn on my notifications and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching. I love you guys so much. I'll see you in my next video. Bye! Would you say you'll try? I've heard that line a thousand times before. I'm not sad, I'm not crying. If you mad, that's fine. But I think that I should go.